Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. As usually on Thursday, I show you the Forzaton and also the championships, what cars I need and what you need to do. So let's have a look. Here at the photo challenge, you need to have a picture in a Nissan and then you have to go to the castle. The castle one is this one here, Bamberg Castle. Just place your car there with a Nissan and then make a picture and you're done. Then the next one, the Forzaton shop. Here you have the Stradale. I believe, I think it's a 10 million car. You definitely need that car. It is such a good car. Always love driving that car. Then you have an emote, a horn, and then you have the TV Sargaris. Um, it's also a good car, but I would prefer the Alfa Romeo. Now let's have a look. What do we need? We need the 2019 Ford Ranger Raptor. We need to have 10 crash landing skills and then a barrel roll and just win 5 races. Okay, so let's have a look at the Ford. Uh, my Ford is ready. Crash landing skills. What's the best thing you can do? Just go here. Just switch to this car. And then drive to this spot. And here you just have fun. You will get the crash landing stuff that we need this is a normal landing but i just there we go there was a crash landing so just have fun here with the raptor and you will be okay then we need a barrel roll well i just took this one the strip here and then i just drove here Let's hope the train is not coming. You don't need to go that fast what I'm doing. But here, you know, you have this fun thingy. There you go. Well, that was... Um, well, whatever that was. But it counted. Um, so that's very fine. Then, we need to win five races. That's very simple. Just go a road race. Go to the Ashmore Heritage Circuit. I'll show you the code. So we go to Solo, Custom Events, and then this one. And this is the code. There you go. And that's it for the Forzaton. That was basically it. It was very easy to do uh, and it was fun. Now, let's have a look. Um, we need for the trial. What do we need for that? We need... I'll put this off. It's Country Japan B700. Uh, that's one car I always take. And I'll keep taking it because I really like it. So, Country. And then we will go to Japan so you can actually see. And it's B, so we select these. Okay. So here you have some cars that you can use from Japan. Now the only car I love to take because it is really fast and really fun is the Mazda MX-5 Miata. That's the car that I take and I will keep taking that because it's good in handling, it's fast, it just has everything. I really like it. Now what can we win from that? As you can see the Toyota MR2 from 95. Then let's go to the Winter Games. Here you can see you win the Ford GT70 from the 70s. It's hard to find car. Now what do we need? Classic Rally D500. Now I'm going to go to my garage. D. And then we have Classic Rally somewhere here. There you go. I have two cars. Uh, I really like the Escort. And basically, this is also a very good car. Um, I didn't tune it, but I know it was uh, a good car. And I, I tuned an A-Class, I think. But these two cars are very good. I will take uh, this one for that. Then, let's go to the next one. Rally Round the Flag. We need C600 Retro Rally. Well, let's have a look at the C600 Retro Rally. Wow, 
Where are you, Retro Rally? There you go. So we have a lot of choices here. As you can see, um, but the C class is slow in championship. I recommend you to take the Renault 5 Turbo. The car is sounds fast, looks fast, drives fast. It's just fast and it's fun, it's good in handling. So I definitely would take that car. You do have other cars, but these are uh, slower. This is also a good car, but I do prefer this one because it's just overall the best car that I tried. Now, what can we win from that championship? We win the... What is that? The Toyota Celica from 94. Then, last chance. A800 Super Saloons. So let's have a look at the Super Saloons. There you go. Now you have way more choices. Um, it is A class, so this one is fast, good in handling, grippy. I would take that one if you really want to have a car that is grippy and everything. It's an all round, very good car. Now I also tested out this one here. Uh, where is it? Yes, this one. Um, it's not tuned. You'd see this has no dirt tires. It's tuned for road, so it has a little stiff suspension. But I did the last championship with that car and I actually won very easy with it. So, uh, the limo is also not a bad car. Uh, BMW is not a bad car. Uh, the R6 is also not a bad car, but if you want to play safe and, ha and have good handling, the Volvo is the best car for that. Now, what would, do we win from the last chance saloon? It is the Mercedes E63. Then here, beginner's truck, C600 off-road. Now, what can we take for that? Let's have a look. Where are you off-roads? Are you here? There you go. Now, you have a few choices as you can see, but I took the most funny one. It's the MB Jeep Willys because it is really fast and it actually handles pretty well. It has fast uh, transition, so if you play on simulation like me, don't steer too crazy. Uh, but I had a lot of fun with the car and I won very easy. I think the drivers were like, well, you couldn't see them anymore. Uh, there are, of course, some other cars. The John Cooper is also not a bad car. The Renegade, is all, these are also not bad cars to use. Um, but I took the Willys Jeep. It's really fun to do. I'll have a look at the C-classes. Yeah, there it is. Now, what do you win from the championship? the beginner's truck we win the hashtag 37 pro 2 truck now here that's the monthly rivals you know you have to qualify 10 times and then you do it one time and then you have to just do it once in a month um and the rivals is also just once in the month then let's go to the studs There you go. Now here, this is, uh, we have two speed zones. Now what can you do? You can start from here. I just stayed in my uh, Ford Raptor. Now as you can see, it was uh, tuned and designed. Uh, it's really, it's standing really low, uh, the car. But as you can see, it is pretty fast. And it's actually still very grippy. And I completely missed the thing. That is of course funny. Um, 
to be honest that uh for that whole life was distracting me i was looking how many seconds it still is so <laughs> i basically completely missed the finish let's do it again And of course it's dark when I'm recording my video. I always love that people can't see much then, but... As you can see, I'm just in 5th gear, I'm doing full throttle. There you go, you see, you can also come from this side, uh, it just depends what you prefer then we have this one uh, I start from here you just uh, go next to the trees here and then you just go full throttle There you go. And then we have this one. It's pretty easy. I actually made a video of how you do every danger sign. Sadly, nobody watched it. Um, but if you need help with the danger sign, you can always watch my video. So what I do is I just drive back. Now the thing is, the truck is really low and it has a long uh, trunk. You can take another car, I would say just take another car because if you do go in the middle, the trunk will uh, actually hit the thing. But if you drive here, there you go. You can actually do it. So basically this truck can also do everything. Then, let's have a look. Um, so at 50% we have a complete new car, the GMC Typhoon. And then at 80% we have the Ford Superfan 3. Now, let's have a look at that GMC. There you go, here it is. Well, sadly, I'll just actually just go to... Uh, Because it's pretty dark outside you can't see the car really there you go this is the car that we win it's a complete new car um, yeah painted a little bit gold and stuff like that uh, but the car looks pretty cool so let's have a look quickly at the upgrades this is always the most interesting as you can see it has the really fast engines so if this car has some grip and handling, this will be a very good and fast car to use. There you go. That's it. I covered everything. I hope you enjoyed the video and that my car choices helped you winning the championships. I'll be streaming tonight at 8.30 CST on Twitch. Hopefully everybody comes and have fun. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye bye.